it's it's something about my expectations of 2024 as a independent contract owner, JB Hunt, as an owner operator, as a person that's trying to run a small company. Um, this year, I just want a level of consistency, man. It's your boy Young, you already know I'm back with another video, man. And today is definitely not a good day, man. Man, first and foremost, if you're new to the channel, all I said you do is like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment down below and tell your boy what's up. If you're old to the channel, you already know what it is, man. Either way it go, we're making it happen and we're kicking down the doors. We ain't gonna give up. It is what it is, dog. It is what it is. But guys, right now, right now now, that we are in line at the infinity lot, man. And I'm telling you, dog, like, man, this is this is scary, dog. This is freaking scary, man. For the simple fact that, bro, all these containers that's packed up, man. Dog, this is scary, dog. This is freaking scary, man. Wow. You remember the last time I showed you? But dog. I'm about to show you what it looked like out here now. This is insane. Look at that. Look at that, dog. That, bro. This is where all the empties at, guys. If you can't find an empty, this is where it's at, man. And I'm talking about that jump run deep, dog. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. I hope this is a good sign. I don't know. You know, like I said, man, this is insane, bro. I don't really think, I don't really think y'all understand. Don't ask me what's going on, bro. I don't know, dog. I don't freaking know. All I do is, uh, you know, let you know what I'm doing, dog. That's all I do. And right now, uh, four days into the year, I ain't doing too much. I ain't doing too much, man. But, <laughs> boy, I don't know. I don't freaking know, dog. It's crazy out here, dog. I can tell you that. It's freaking crazy out here. All right, yo. So let's go ahead and get this party started, man. Picking up a freaking load uh, out of Austin Rail, and we go take it to Uline, man. This trailer is old. It's probably older than me. I don't know, but I got a subscriber that always tell us, you know, when the trailer was manufactured and all. So. If you need to know, I don't know if that information right there help y'all, driver, but uh, go on here and let us know about this trailer, man. But this trailer look kind of old to me. But yeah, picking up this load and taking the U-line, man. All these brilliant ideas about people that made these machines. Real smart, man. Real freaking smart. If they can do it, we can do it too. But don't let me forget to tell you, if you're new to the channel, all I said you do is like, comment, and subscribe. Drop a comment down below and tell your boy what's up. If you're old to the channel, man, you already know what it is. We're making it happen. Just picked us up one, man. Finna go and deliver it. You already know what we do. Don't nothing change but the weather. And today is feeling good. Let's get it. So we made it into the rail yard. And man, when I tell you back there, it's looking real crazy. You know, it's looking crazy, dog. Try that at home, man. I don't want you to knock your teeth out. You gotta know what you're doing when you're doing it, man. But yeah, man, back here looking crazy, dog. This is this at the whole Fairburn yard right now. Man, 
when you see them one container on the ground like that, man. Them things normally stacked up. Look back there. Look at that. It's terrible, dog. They ain't looking too good for the for 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 IC drivers, dog. Like <sighs> that lady probably think I'm talking to myself. But back, they looking real it's terrible, man. You normally see them things stacked. Four, five high, man. Seeing one on the ground? Mm. Guarantee you, we will have some days this week. They ain't got no load for us. No work. Hey, so y'all know, we still got day, uh, daylight. We don't like to leave nothing on the table, man. We, you know, we get what we can get while we still got daylight. But uh, we took that load to Jefferson, Georgia, which was a good load, heavy load, but it was a good load. But uh, picked up a trailer out there. We brought it back to Fairburn Rail to engage that trailer. Um, of course, y'all already know I'm a hustler, man. So, you know, I see what else they had out there. You know, any more loads, any more, you know, ways to bring some more revenue in. Cause I like to start out Monday strong, man. You know, Monday is a few day. So, put fuel this morning, so I need to make sure that I cover that fuel. Even though, I know I done covered the fuel by now. Um, but, I like to get a little head that way tomorrow. If we come in and we feel a little lackadaisical, we don't feel like running as hard, you know, tomorrow we can pretty much make us, a, a, you know, a good 500. And we be good. But anyway, right now they got us picking up a chassis out of uh, Fairburn Rail, and we go drop it at the Infinity lot. Right up the street. Um, quick little drop. P probably come back and get get one more. Take it up there, drop it off. And if I can get a load going toward the house, I won't be no more greedy, man. I'll just, go on to, I'll, I'll just go on to the house, man, because that'll do it for me. I spoke too fast, man. Look back there. Look back there on the back, man. You know, them, them containers don't be stacked up. Four, five high, man. You see them single down there on the ground, dog. That ain't a good look, man. That ain't what I like to see. But anyway, we can go ahead and take this chassis, man, and we will come back and get another one, and we're gonna take that, and look like that's gonna be it for the day. Uh, tomorrow is a late start. Yup, they just sent the message saying we start that 12 tomorrow. So here we go, what I just been talking about, but, it is what it is. We gonna stay grounded, we gonna stay grounding, we gonna stay grinding, and we gonna make it happen one way or another, bro. It don't matter. We gonna work with what we got. Next day. So we out here getting fuel, man. It's, it, man, I'm telling you, it's, it ain't, I don't even know how to say it. It's the wind chill, man, that's making it super cold. But man, it is freezing out here, man. We got our first load. You know, we got our load and uh, we finna take it to uh, Jefferson. Drop it off like it's a bad habit. We'll get an empty out there and we'll go to Fairburn, man. But it is freezing out here, guys. I'll get with y'all in a minute, man. It's cold. You put a few. Yes, sir. Y'all know what we got. We got that weight, baby. We had to go get that receipt now. Y'all know that. Y'all know we get that receipt now. Come on. Come on. Let's go make it happen, boys. And ladies, let's go make it happen. Come on now. Y'all know we done made it safe and sound to get this load here. And dog, I bought me some socks yesterday from Costco. I ain't gonna say the name of them because if they wanna they want to uh, reach out to your boy and they want to do business. But I'm telling you, I bought me some freaking socks yesterday out of Costco, man. And when I tell you these socks feel like cushion, man. Mm, these some good socks, man. Go to Costco. Eight pack. I think it was for $12.99, if I'm not mistaken. Good socks, man. Go get you some. In and out, dog. In and out. You know? Coco still don't look bad. It rained on the last week after we got a wash, but she's still looking good. Let's go drop this trailer, baby. 
Y'all dog down ain't doing no work. Look at that. I see you. Back up to a trailer. That's how I really find out if it's empty or not. Sometimes you really gotta go back there and put an eye on it because, you know, it sounds shallow, but it really don't be empty. But I'm pretty sure this one's empty. Um, so guys, we're gonna call this video, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna entitle this video, My Expectations of 2024. That's what we're gonna talk about this video, man. My Expectations of 2024. Y'all saw in the beginning of the video, how, you know, our drop lot is full of stacked containers. And you know, that worry us, you know, over here at JV Hunt, people say it's over for in a motor. Sorry if the wind is blowing, but it's windy out here. But uh people say it's over for in a motor. And guys, you know, my expectations is somewhat some just some some type of consistency. You know, last year we came out uh probably one of the worst years you know is the for me was the worst year that I had in the motor. But at the end of the day, when I did my year in, you know, tallying up how much I made, how much I spent on repairs and et cetera, et cetera, I really didn't do too bad, guys. As bad as last year was, man. And, uh, you know, I'm thankful for that. I'm grateful for that. And uh, making sure this trailer empty. So this year, my expectations, you know, I ain't gonna be too, I ain't gonna be too crit, uh, crucial on my expectations this year. I just want some type of consistency. You know what I'm saying? Um, I do want work to pick up, just like I'm sure all ICs want work to pick up. You know what I'm saying? But if it don't pick up, if it don't get back to where it once was, at least. I want it to be consistent, you know? I don't want to be left, you know, out in the wilderness, man, because if we gonna work, say we gonna work, if we not gonna work, you know, give us a heads up, man. Don't don't leave us out here for the dead because last year, we don't know we was going to come in. But we could talk about more of my expectations of 2024. Let me go ahead and get this trailer right, hook up, send my unloaded car, and we gonna talk about it. Yo, so as I see here and wait on them to uh, terminate this load and put me on my next assignment, um, it's something about my expectations of 2024 as a independent contract on the JB Hunt, as an owner operator, as a person that's trying to run a small company. Um, this year, I just want a level of consistency, man. You know, this year, I feel like after last year, I have to somewhat start building again. You know what I'm saying? Building my business account business building my savings um because last year you know as you guys know it was a rough year for us as truckers man and uh by the grace of god i was able to save a lot of money prior to the prior year uh to last year um and it came in handy because last year i was able to when we had downtime when we didn't have work um on, on weeks that we really didn't have any loads and we really didn't make the money that we were used to making I was able to reach over there in my business. I was able to reach in my savings and I was able to pay myself throughout the year. You know what I'm saying? So guys, when you up, put some of that money up, man. Don't don't just blow through that money. Yes, I go out and I try to buy me nice things and uh, I try to treat myself here and there, but I rarely do that. And when I do it, I just do it probably once a year or whatever the case may be. But other than that, I'm really t handling my responsibility as a man, as a father and uh, just putting up for a rainy day because I understand those days are coming no matter how, how good you having it. It's gonna be some rainy days, man. And I understand that in the trucking game, um, these trucks break down, let me knock on wood. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, Coco been doing pretty good. I know I got some, a lot of uh, external work I want to still get done to a lot of internal work I want to get done to but for the most part she's making it do what it do right now and then we could try to you know run it run as as JB Hunt is willing to give us the work man we could try to run and save some of that money back and uh you know go from there but this year man I just want a level of consistency man I just want to start back uh 
building that cushion back up, man. You know, because it was we had it, we had it at a good, solid number, man. Um, but I'm blessed to say that I had it when I needed. So um, this year, I just want to continue to uh, work hard. I want to continue to put out content, continue to inform um, all the upcoming drivers. Is if you're trying to get in the motor, you're trying to, you know, be shoulder to shoulder and want to know what somebody do, man. You know, this channel is for you. Um, we going to have a good time, man. You know, we're going to really have a good time and we're going to really make it do what it do, man. What you see is what you get. Bob Moore Young. Um, so this year, my expectations is a level of consistency and we want to try to build that cushion back. That was my goals of 2024 and uh, we're going to make it happen, dog. We're going to make it happen.